At the same time, there was a show of support for Brown in Birmingham as more than a dozen community members gathered in Kelly Eagle Park. We're here today to be in affinity uh, with the family. They sincerely requested a nationwide day of peace as it relates to the slaying of their son. We're here to celebrate and recognize the life of Michael Brown today because we all are Michael Brown. Ted Matthews, head of the Outcast Voters League, spearheaded the ceremony that included the releasing of 18 doves, the lighting of 18 candles, and the placement of 18 red roses, signifying the 18 years Brown lived. We also called on law enforcement to work closer together with citizens and call for an end to racism. We need to come out of our political movement and realize that we're in this country together. We're all one blood. God made all nations from one blood. And we need to solve everything. We need to be peace. 